I'm just yelling and listening to some music right now. That's how the kids do it, right? Upside down. Maybe they do it like this on the back. Probably like this. I'm Landon. This is Lando 27 Music. These are MPOW Bluetooth headphones. These are the 059 Bluetooth headphone over ear hi fi stereo wireless headset foldable soft memory protein earmuffs with built in mic. Is a built in mic on this? Oh, I didn't see that. Oh, maybe it's on the cable. No, I don't know. And wired mode for PC, cell phones, TV. That's what they say on Amazon. Okay, so I'm normally guitar, right? Guitar kind of stuff. My channel, I usually do, I usually do guitars, amps, stuff like that, microphones. Anyways, Empow reached out to me. They saw the word music probably in my, in the name of my channel, right? And hey, it is Lano 27 Music. I listen to music, so why not check these out? They said they were gonna send them out to me. And I thought, you know what, what color is me? What color would I want? Pink. They said we're gonna send them out. I waited about four weeks. When I was waiting for them, I thought, how do you review headphones? And I still don't know, but I'm still making this video. So, you know, I, the only thing I can really think of is, it'd be like me doing a review of Coke and Pepsi and kind of drinking them on screen and then telling you what I think about each one. But really, you can't really know which one is better because this is gonna be my ears, which are damaged, I think. What, what'd you say? Um, I'll just do my best. So what am I gonna do in this video? I'm gonna turn them on, show how they work. Well, you saw in the little intro there. Did you see that? Did I show that yet? Unboxed, right? What do you get with them? You get these folded up headphones that pop out like that and they expand, which is good for me. I've got a massive head. Now I'm gonna yell because I'm wearing them. I have a really big, big head. Uh, it comes with USB charger like that and it comes with your uh, audio cable in case you don't want to use the Bluetooth and it comes with a bag that they can go in. That's pretty cool. $44.99 on Amazon.com. They're about 50 something on Amazon.ca. See on the side here that's got these buttons. This is how you sync it. You turn it on by holding down the button. It detects what Bluetooth devices you have around. So I'm going to do that in a second. Basically you're going to watch me listen to music. Oh, you just shut the video off. I know, I get it, I get it. So really in this video, all I can really talk about is my impression of how they sound compared to another pair of headphones that I have. These ones, look at these things. These are, these are getting old. They're getting up there. I think I got these in 1999. They're Sony MDR V500. And there's the old uh, coily cable. When these things came out, Bluetooth was something like if you banged your mouth on the stairs and what happened to your teeth. That's what Bluetooth was. Bluetooth did not exist. So I'll try the Bluetooth, but I'll also plug them in, see how they, see how they sound. I'm going to sync them up with my Mac Mini, which I'm using right here. Let's see how we can do this. Bluetooth, all right, discoverable. I'm going to hit the uh, little button on the side here. Oh, Siri just said something to me. Siri, are you in there? It was, I heard, I heard a person talking. It powered them on and I'm going to hold it down again. Oh, sounds like, uh, I didn't, uh, buckle my seatbelt. Come on. You can do it. Bluetooth. Discover me. I'm holding it. Oh, pairing. Hey, and pow. There we go. Let's connect. I am now ye phone one connected. That's what it told me. Okay. Uh, I'm going to pick two types of songs. I'm going to pick one with like very intricate, delicate, beautiful guitar and see how that sounds, right? And then I will do something with like a, a bass, bass heavy kind of stuff. So I thought I'd pick this one here. You're not going to hear a thing. You're just going to pretend. If you don't know the song, pretend you know it. What? That's not even making sense. Shine On You Crazy Diamond by Pink Floyd. It's got David Gilmore's signature, beautiful, eloquent, delicious Stratocaster playing in the beginning here. So let me cue that up. It's a 13 minute song. So I'm going to listen to the whole thing and you can watch me listen to it. I'm just kidding. I'm going to skip ahead to when the guitar kicks in. Here it is. Beautiful. 
It's pretty quiet. I can hear it. It's not really standing out that much. Okay, let me pause that. Yeah, so I heard that. Now I'm going to compare it with the actual cable sound. Okay, let me go back again. Yeah. Okay. So on Bluetooth, it's very hard to hear the guitar, the lead guitar. And I'm going to shut you off. I'm going to quickly go. It was a little bit better on the cable. Now I'm going to quickly go over to this one. These were like a hundred bucks back in 1999. I don't think they even make this one anymore, but let's go plug it in. These aren't as comfortable. I'll, I'll, I'll say these are pretty comfortable. There is better definition with the highs and the mids in these, for sure. I think that might be what's lacking in that. So let's try, let's go back. Let's try something with uh, a bit more low end. I know there's a Green Day song here that has a lot of... Hitching a Ride, you know that one? Bump, 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 dun, 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 dun. That's got some good low stuff. Let's try that. That sounded pretty decent. Uh, it sounded better than the Pink Floyd stuff. Okay, this is just my quick opinion, but there's a noticeable difference between Bluetooth audio and directly wired. Let's see how this sounds now with compared to uh, these these old Sony's. Yeah, I think that's good enough. I got my uh, I got my verdict. I got my opinions. I got everything. Uh, okay, here's what I want to say. Construction's nice, right? They seem well built. They look good. I, did, I can't speak for the durability. I don't know if they last in cold weather, like where I'm from. I'm in the North Pole. Would they crack and fall apart? Can't say. Uh, they smell like a factory. They look cool. What are they trying to compare themselves to? I believe, correct me if I'm wrong, I think these are trying to emulate some Beats, right? Some expensive headphones from Beats. Oh, is that where the headphone? Okay, it looks like there is a microphone. I see a little hole there show right there uh, okay my two cents definitely has a higher definition in terms of the mids and the highs the clarity is better in these these cost a lot more so you kind of expect that the low end is pretty good in these they're also closed what do they call it is that called closed back these go right around your ears and they they close around so they cancel out a lot of sound around you so these ones don't do that. That's not what these are for. So, do I think they're worth the money? Like I said, when I when I got them, how do you do a review about headphones? That's tough. That's tough. I'll be honest. All joking aside, I think they're okay. They're not amazing. Just because I'm listening through these other ones, uh, they definitely sounded a lot better plugged in versus... Bluetooth connection so that might be something to consider because I think a lot of people might be actually using them for Bluetooth right maybe with your phone um, I definitely like to thank Mpow for sending them out let me try them <laughs> oh. <clears throat> they're headphones they're headphones that's it okay if you're interested in them how much do they cost the $44.99 in the United States of America and something like 50 something in Canada. They're okay, they're okay. They're not amazing me. Um, I have some Sennheiser headphones that aren't with me right now. They're not Bluetooth enabled, they're, they're plug-in only. And those things are amazing. 
So I do have some experience with different types of headphones. They're, they're okay, I keep saying that. The plastic is a little bit cheap on this part here, but they look nice, 20 hour battery. That's impressive, I'd be impressed with that. Everybody's having a good time with them here on their website, on the Amazon site. Hold on, maybe I should do what they're doing first. How is she doing that? Like this? There we go. That sounds a bit better. Oh no, hold on. Okay. Is that better? That's usually how I listen to music. They're headphones. I'm Lando. This is Lando27 Music. I like and subscribe. Like and subscribe to my channel if you like it. Uh, as always, play guitar and have fun. Or play headphones. This time, play headphones. Alright, I'll see you in the next video. Take care.